Good evening and welcome back. Now it's the 19th of the 9th 2017 and we've got some fantastic video footage and lots of images to go through on this video. As again we are being lied to aren't we? The government, the powers that be are just keeping this real quiet. We can see the strange colours now, the reflections and the haze. So please enjoy this footage. Now I would like to just explain something as well on this uh, image you can see that this is a true image of the Nibru system. Now I'd like to say it wasn't my own image. This was brought in by different sources, some fantastic friends to show me this. Now I'd like to say as well that it has attracted the uh, newspapers of the UK, the Daily Star and the Daily Express. Now they s brought up a um, some information about my channel on their um, web page. Now I'd like to say as well that I believe that nothing is going to happen on the 23rd of September this month 2017. I've never turned around and said that there is going to be anything that's going to happen around them times. Now again this was passed to me from a a secret source and the person would like to remain anonymous because it is a true image. Now also you've got to uh, think out the box with this as well because one image okay just the one image out of thousands of images that are people are showing on their YouTube channels and also website pages of the Nibru system that they're picking up objects all the time now we've got to th as I said we've got to think hard with this because why on earth of one image you can see on the screen has caused the newspapers to start bringing out stories about channels and information of what we're showing one image on the screen because I believe this is a true image of the Nibru system this is what they don't want us to see so Again, I believe that NASA will have a conference about this and bring out another video to try and dumb us down again, to try and not for us to focus on the truth. So again, we've just got to keep focused, keep positive and be ourselves spiritually. We need to keep spiritually and keep strong because we know that this system is coming in. We can see the changes in the skies and we can see we can see that there is a huge problem with our sun right now. It's dimming as it rises in the sky. Everything seems to be getting much darker. Chemtrail activity and it just gets stranger each day. So I'm going to now show some fantastic images from around the world and some fantastic photos because this channel is made for you. Because all these images that are coming in are not provided by myself. They're provided from many people that can see that there is a big change in their, their skies and they can see the system. They know something is much different. That's why they provide the videos. Fantastic, genuine people that want to seek out the truth. We all want the truth, don't we? So please enjoy this video and thank you for listening to this. And again, we just got to carry on. Okay, now we've got a video that's come in from a kind subscriber called Curtis. Now this guy is out all the time looking at the sundown. Now he is seeing different colours. Now we've got to be open-minded again on this channel and we need to be as truthful as possible for all the subscribers and be spiritually minded and be clear-headed with this. That's not believe or get affected by these negative comments. Now this again has to be a true situation okay all the time we're providing the information and again we've just got to be very very genuine of what we see. So I'm gonna play this video for you now I hope it works because I had some trouble with it five minutes ago but it is spectacular what this kind subscriber sees. Are you serious? Oh, oh, what would that is on Sunday? No, it ain't. What is that? Oh my God! This is two, three, man, this is crazy. 
I'm zoomed in, huh? Hey, hey. You're zoomed out. I'm zoomed in. Here's out. Holy. Last time I zoom in, I mean, I'm Lord. Yeah. Wow, that is, un that is like freaking crazy, man. There's fire in the sky. And it stretches from probably 800 miles, if you think about the way the crow flies from here. Oh my goodness. Look at their reflections. Matt Rogers, please look at this. And then we go all the way south. That's going over there to, to that is just too far away. Oh, what's this, that's something round over there? Now listen, listen, this, what is that? They've seen the, oh, it's, it's crazy. There ain't no way. We've got too many things going on. Right there. It's cool, ain't it? It's dangerous. Rain. Oh, did you see, see that? Oh. It's, <laughs> I thought I was shooting. I thought you yeah, was in there. This is central South Florida. I live right on the south tip of Lake Okeechobee in Belle Glade. And I get these things every night when it's it's just like they're hiding something. They look at there, that's got too much. We used to have one orange ball go down right in the middle, now is it. This is crazy. Well, y'all know what time it is. Prepare to get right with God. The revelations are about ready to come to fruition in September. September, no, September 23rd. I already got marked on the calendar. If we get to October 30th, I think we're going to be ha all right. But What's that ball over there, though? No, 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 keep going up that. That's, the, I know, babe. It's weird. I think it's cool. Uh, my phone won't take a picture of it. I want to take a picture of it. All I got to do, I can take a picture. Watch. Bam. Yep, there it is. It ain't lying. Okay, gang, this is this is this is Curtis Fulham signing out. Bye. Okay, thank you, Curtis, for sending this in, this video. And it is very spectacular. You can see again, just looking on that horizon to the northeast. Look at that round object right in the center of the screen. There is definitely something huge reflecting that's out there. Now, I'm gonna go to other subscribers' images and videos as well, so please keep safe. As again, once we get past the uh, September to October, we just got to keep researching. We've got to keep looking at the skies and keep noticing the changes. The reflections are very huge now. They're coming in strong. So please again, take care and I will be back to show you images now. Okay, we've got this first attachment that's coming in from Gary Crockford. Now this kind subscriber is from Fenian Falls in Ontario and he is based in Canada and you can see again look on the horizon look at this red haze you can see the color of the soul and we're seeing this red haze across the horizon now this kind subscriber takes his dog out for walks and he notices the changes I mean look again he says that this year out of any other year the trees are just not growing they're just dying all across uh, that's terrible isn't it again we're seeing this across the world on other images that are being brought in thank you for this image and also I'll move on to another image this is the next image for this kind friend that sent this in from Canada now what he's done is he's zoomed in so we've got more of a picture of what's going on here as well this haze again you can see the two colors can't you in this shadow that's coming through two colors in the sky and it is very sad to see what's going on around the world isn't it with all this plant life because NASA and other government people they just don't care do they using the military for doing what they're doing they are not coming out with the truth to letting people know of what's happening with our plants trees and ourselves our humans on this planet are being hugely affected by this it needs to come out it has to come out now okay these next attachments are coming from Alexandra from Germany now she states in the um, email that was sent in which I've translated strange skies in Germany and it really does look very strange 
she states as well that it has got far, it has got far too much darker. Chemtrails again, this pink haze. Now I'm going to go to the next image. It's overwhelming as well because she is seeing the truth. Okay, now I do know that the image is quite blurry, but this image is pointing east as the sun is going down. Now, can you see that pink haze? This is not from the soul of the sun. And this is what she states in her email as well. She's very shocked and she wants these photographs to come out onto video so all of us can see this. So we have to uh, give her respect for doing so. All of you deserve huge respect for actually doing this to showing everybody what you're seeing. So again, thank you very much, Alexandra, for your images. We have a new attachment that's come through, again from Mary from Swansea in the UK. This lady subscriber is very persistent. We've seen her footage on other videos and she states as well that white object up there and also very dark to the left hand side chemtrails from all parts of the horizons as well. Dark shadows and also a strange tint on the land. This shadow, this white reflection, it just seemed to be like an eclipse, this lady subscriber Mary says. And also, I mean, thank you for sending this in as well, because we are seeing the same skies all across the world now. Okay, this image is from Mr. Wade Cross. Now, this guy, very persistent, and you can see just absolute blatancy that they have covered the whole of the skies. Now, it is amazing to say this as well because I'm still getting emails from other people stating that they're just clouds. We are just seeing clouds on these photographs. We're not seeing chemtrails. We don't believe there is such a thing called a chemtrail and we are all mad because, again, what we're seeing on the screen here is chemtrails and also just trash and also ash that's up thousands of feet high they're hiding what's coming down from the inner solar system and this is happening all the time and eventually we will see red oxide dust we will see red oxide on the ground it would just be everywhere it'd be on our rivers it'd be everywhere and still the media will say that it's something else they don't want anybody to clock on to the truth so Again, you can see clearly on the screen here, this is huge evidence that we are being sprayed every single day. And they are hiding, they're hiding reflections from the coming system. Now, again, I do not know a day, a time, an hour, but what I do know is that these colours in the sky, reflections and the trash, it is getting more and more evident. It's getting more clearer. So thank you again for this photograph. This is another up-to-date image proving there is something really wrong with our skies. We've said this before many a times. People down on the land still think that everything is okay. Now look again to the area of the Sol of the Sun. It's the wrong shape we're getting a reflection to the left hand side at the 11 o'clock position. Look here as well, other colours. There is a huge pink light source coming through from Wormwood. Look at these trails in the skies as well. Look how dark it is at the sky here. It was light this, this morning around half past nine, 10 a.m. in the morning. Very dim and dark skies. There's something going on. We've said this all the time. And the reflections as well on these building tops, this white haze, again just like a huge mirror in the sky. This is lens flare, let's not worry about this. We're just taking note now aren't we, of every day we see these images, they're just becoming more and more evident. The next image as well just clearly shows chemtrails, harp clouds, trash thousands of feet high and dim skies on the land, I mean look at this. Look at the trees as well. The tops of the trees are being destroyed and no one is saying a word. This is our planet and it's being destroyed. And because these, 
all this trash that's coming out the sky onto these trees from the chemtrails. You've got to imagine as well what we're what's happening to us. We're breathing all this in. I mean, it's getting much more evident now, isn't it? Thank you again for this image. Here on this next image as well, taken at a different angle. Look at those chemtrails. And also, can you see this haze here? Now, look at this rainbow effect. Now, the solar sun will be to the right-hand side here, but there's something else. Something else is reflecting through. Could be anything. Now, again, just dark skies. Another spectacular image, because they are spraying everywhere, aren't they? They are being sprayed all the time. Yes, we see some glare on this image, but also we still see this reflection to the left hand side here, chemtrails and dim skies. Very dark again. Humanity have got used to this, but again we've just got to keep going and showing the truth. Here on the next photograph as well, again you can see the trash that's being sprayed up there in the skies. Now, the most interesting part about this photograph isn't the lens flare you see here. It's how dark it is. Look at the dimness on these buildings. Look how dark up in the skies. I mean, look at this chemtrail again. Very, very dark, reflecting on these um, houses, this mobile home. I mean, look at this. Everywhere it is dimming. And this proves to me as well that there is a huge problem up there, out in the inner solar system. Okay, I've just got this image straight away, right now from Germany, from Alexandra, again, the subscriber that showed images just moments ago at the beginning of the video. Look at this image again. She's taken these right now as we speak. Now, that pink haze from the other side of the sun down, that red reflection again, something else is rising. Now, it is important to take note to look on the other side of sundown on the horizons. We're seeing a lot of, of the red haze now. So thank you. Thank you for sending this in. And please, again, keep safe. Okay, we've got some other fantastic attachments coming in from Julia. Now, this kind subscriber is from Indiana, and she also is taking images right now. And she states that it's far too pink. We're getting a pink haze that she states in a long email. And also, God bless you too, because you are a fantastic person that's providing the information. Now, also, you can clearly see, can't you, this pink haze. This is lens flare. Let's not worry about this. Let's forget about this. What we're more interested in is this pink haze. More trash being sprayed to cover the truth. This white object again. Just absolutely outstanding, and thank you for this image. She also states as well these strange colours. Chemtrails, not normal clouds. These are poisonous to our health, to our plant life, and to our animals. Everything on the world is being harmed. And also, it is a situation, isn't it? Because the Lord is going to be very unhappy with this. Very upset because Mother Earth is being destroyed. And it's being destroyed right in front of us. So people have got to get right now. we really got to get right now with this. Because the rapture is heading closer towards us. There's going to be a huge event. And there's going to be strange weather patterns. There's also another storm that's happening right now. People losing those houses of theirs and their property, their savings. I mean, these storms, I've said this on another video, when that storm was happening, that there will be more storms. And this is happening right now. This is the start of the rapture. So I'm going to now go to another fantastic image from Julie, this kind subscriber. Okay, this is the last image from Julie. 
We know this is lens flare, but again, very, very dark up in the skies. This white object again, and this pink reflection. The pink haze from the Nibiru system. We've got other objects that are with our sun. And we will all see it in our lifetimes. So thank you for this photograph and thank you for your respect. We've also just had this image come in as well from Mr. Wade Cross. Now, he has got his camera and he's taking images right now as we are playing this video. Now, look at those chemtrails again. The dark skies and the haze on the horizon. And these strange ripples in the chemtrails, these lines are Again, Harp is working at high power, causing all this of lines in the skies. So thank you very much for this image as well. Okay, we've got this other fantastic subscriber that sent these images in as well, called Raquel Bollinger. Now, this kind subscriber, New Zealand, look at the um, activity in the sky here. Look at this haze, this orange reflection again from another heavenly body. And she also states that it got very, very hazy, very dim and dark for that time of the day, 4 p.m. And she states as well that it has never been as dark as that ever from any other year. Look at those... Um, it's all chemtrails, it's all toxic, and it's happening right now. I'm going to move to another one of these images from Raquel as well because these are fantastic. I mean look at this photograph as well. This was brought in and I mean look at the red haze, this orange haze. Look at the this here. This is part of the soul, the sun. Look how yellow it is here and then we've getting this red haze. This is all chemtrails all thick in the sky. Look at the trees here in New Zealand. There is a lot going on. There really is. And this is from the Nibiru system. We've got this other colour that's coming in. So again, thank you for this image. These images are true images. What you're seeing is a haze in the sky. They spray to hide the truth. This is the last image as well where you can see that haze the trash, the ash in our atmosphere is so evident now. Is I mean, everything is uh, changing. Thank you again for this photograph. And I'm going to move now to other photographs. And also, please, please keep safe and God bless you too. Okay, we've got another fantastic video that's come in from Dennis. Now, we have seen videos in the past from this kind gentleman, a good friend that emails every single day and he is persistent. He never stops to looking up the heavens to seeing the changes. And he also states that this white object has got even more whiter, much brighter, and he's taken the video footage here. So I'm going to play this video for all of you now. 18 September 2017. Okay, that was an excellent video as well from Dennis and he states again in his email that it was like a huge mirror. It was far too white, not like the sun that we've seen before and also just um, chemtrails, just a haze. As he noticed those military planes early hours of the morning spraying the skies. So thank you again for your respect. This is fantastic Dennis, thank you. This next image is coming from Latia Ashi. Now, this subscriber is also very persistent as well, and she states in her email that this looks very strange to be chemtrails. You can see again 
these lines in the sky with this huge reflection, this orange reflection, not from our solar sun. Something else as we've got Helion in our system and other objects that are travelling with Wormwood. It is a very serious situation, isn't it? Just absolutely outstanding. And I am also wanting to send a message out to all of you that I will not stop. I will carry on and I will be as truthful as I can and to be myself, to be calm and also very positive to get these messages out because it's important because we should all now be positive in the Nibiru community. So again, thank you for this image. Okay, we've got a fantastic image here as well from a kind subscriber that's very persistent, sends comments on the uh, message board as well. Fantastic friend. And states as well that this reflection that he's noticing in the skies is from the blue Kachina. It was very blue. Very, very blue up there. And people are starting to notice this as well. I mean, look at this shadow. This blue colour here as well. And I just want to say that I respect every single subscriber and I feel also that it's important to the Nibiru community that we've made friends and also to show their photographs as well. It really is important. So again, thank you for your respect, your long email and big respect to you because you are a fantastic person. You all are and we all have to just keep researching and keep looking and hunting for the truth. Here we have as well another fantastic photo that's coming from Jeffrey Potter. This kind subscriber sending a lot of uh, information as well and he was out and noticed this pink haze. Look again. This is a very true image as well. Look at this yellow colour of the soul. Look at these chemtrails again. They spray in the sky. Look at this reflection that's coming here as well. This pink reflection this to the left side not from the soul from another heavenly body that's traveling out there between us and the Sun we are going to see this pink reflection for many of more months maybe possibly a year but we are going to see huge changes before then we're going to see again just more evidence of earthquakes higher magnitudes we're going to see more storms, a lot more things, but the media won't tell you or explain to you what is causing these storms. What is the true reason? Now, they are using harp to try and calm things down, this man-made device that they've been building for years and they're using it to this day to try and control the jet stream. But Mother Earth is a lot stronger than these little machines that they've been working on to try and manipulate the weather patterns, to try and calm things down, to dampen things down. And as this is happening, our skies are dimming because Nemesis, the sun's companion, is like a wrecking ball. It is just hammering its way through. As the other celestial bodies, the known ones that we know of today, are just playing safe. They're just going about their business and just as Mother Earth is, just orbiting around the Sun. But this huge binary twin is a loose cannon. It really is. And this is what's going to cause a huge pole shift. And this is what these are reflections are that we're seeing in our skies. More and more evidence is coming in. So I'm going to go to another image now, but this is fantastic. Okay, we've got a video just come in from Paul Brankin. Another kind subscriber sends photographs in and also video footage. And it's a very short video, it's only 10 seconds long, but I would like you to hear his words because it just shows that people around the world are getting really agitated by what's going on up there in the skies. Look at this. There's two of them. There's the third. There's the fourth. Absolutely disgraceful. He is absolutely right. It is absolutely disgraceful. We are always seeing chem planes 
not the blue skies. When we do see blue skies, half an hour to 45 minutes later, it's all trash. It's all haze in the skies to hide ash that's coming up from the inner of the solar system. There's lots of things now that are happening. So again, Paul, thank you for this video. Thank you. Also, these images are coming in from Paul as well. And he states on the photographs to the other side, you look in northeast, this pink haze that's behind all this chemtrails, this lines in the skies as well. I saw this this morning as well to the northeast, a haze, chemtrails, the solar sun here to this side, and then why are they chemtrailing the horizon here? I did see this activity about three months ago and I went out because I saw a red haze and then I saw this object going down on the horizon. There is something seriously going on and also people, other people just want you to forget about the past. They just want us to be controlled. They want us to just take notice of our mobile phones, our TVs and just forget about what's happened in the past. There's so many things and so many truthers that have come out with the truth but it gets so dampened down they try and cover this up all the time so again thank you for this image we have here more evidence of spraying chemtrails and this ash there's something here that's coming down can you see these lines very, very strange curly lines in the sky. We've seen this a lot on other people's photographs as well. All this is chemtrails. Just done in images as well, so thank you for this photograph. Here's another stunning image as well from Vienna Wellesley, and she is from Rio de Janeiro, another part of the world, and states as well the plant life is being poisoned. She points as well on an email to the right hand side. The trees are just dying. You can see this, can't you? Burnt away. Look at all this ash and also chemtrails, harp clouds and strange coloured skies. Just another fantastic photograph and also your information has been read and yes, you are fully awake to the truth. This is the next image as well just so much activity of these military planes that spray our skies. Over there as well, in Rio de Janeiro, the military are doing the same as what the military are doing all across every single sky. This is, again, a huge agenda. They are working together, the governments around the world, to doing this, to dampening down the truth. So thank you for these images and big respect to you. Okay, as we were just going through those images, I've just got these in from the same friend, Vivina Wesley. And, I mean, also look at that chemtrail, that huge strange colour reflecting from it as well. And this other haze. Look at this. Very, very strange skies. Thank you for this image. Again, more evidence of these strange formations pink reflections from Wormwood. Look at the colours and remember back in the day we never saw these formations. We never saw many of chemtrails or this pink haze we're seeing in the sky all the time. Think back at 2014, 2015 and 2016. There wasn't much of this was there? But now this year it has got a lot stronger. So thank you again for this photograph and I will move on to the next image from this kind person. Here again on this other photograph, this pink haze from Wormwood. Dark skies. I mean, look at all this. This is again just poisons in our skies, reflecting the system. There'd be ash miles high as well. We will see this oxide coming down to the ground. This also is another true image. You can see that pink reflection, can't you? And all this with the other reflection from the soul. Now I've got a verse, a couple of verses for you as well, that I've read and I've taken note of. John 14, chapter. And if I go and prepare a place for you, 
I will come back and take you to be with me, that you also may be where I am. Luke 10.20 However, do not rejoice that the Spirit submit you, but rejoice that your names are written in heaven. Mark 13.32 But about the day or hour no one knows, not even the angels in heaven, nor the Son, but only the Father. Revelation 3.10 Since you have kept my command to endure patiently, I will also keep you from the hour of trial that is going to come on the whole world to test the inhabitations of the earth. Matthew 24.30 Then will appear the sign of the Son of the man in heaven, and then all the people of the earth will, when they see the Son of Man coming on the clouds of heaven, with the power and great glory, and he will send his angels with the loud trumpet call, and they will gather his elect from the four winds, from one end of the heavens to the other. Very true words. And also, thank you very much for this kind image.